Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor. Welcome to the free Unity assets for December, January 2022-2023. This has an awesome collection of characters, 2D assets, editor extensions, and so much more to make your life easier in Unity. Be sure to check out all the links in the description for of over 60 different assets for this month. And towards the end of the video, I will show you the free assets for Unreal Engine, which you can also import into Unity 2 which I have a tutorial for. So be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 175 different scripts, assets and projects that you cannot find anywhere else. So first of all, we have Demon Girl, which is a female style demon character, which is a high quality mesh, which includes 23 different animations for a humanoid movement with 14 legacy ready clips with different color sheets, with all real time fabric cloths and weapons included. The next one is the 2D Neighborhood, and this is a set of houses, decorative trees, items to create a fantastic neighborhood with loads of different style designs with over 40 different 2D designs with parallax effects, anything for roads, tables, fences, cars, trees and everything to get yourself started. The next one is the C Sharp Generator and this allows you to create scripts in a much easier way. So normally you would right click in Unity and you'd be able to create a mono behavior script. This allows you to easily create quicker scripts which will have you kick start whether you need to create a scriptable object, whether you want a basic mono behavior, whether you want to create a struct, a class, interface or an enum and it can get it all together with just one click. The next one is the Super Grotto Escape Pack. This is a complete 2D platformer asset pack, which is a 16-bit style, a player character, loads of sprites with enemies, props, for everything in this style. The next one is something called Lazy Builder, and this is an entire library which doesn't come with anything built in by default, but has access to copyright free to use models, which you can pull straight from the interface directly into Unity without you needing the overhead of all these assets in your project at any one time. The next one is the Pirate Customized with a humanoid based rig and cloth physics on each part of it with PBR related textures up to 4K resolution on each of the asset with a pirate at about 260,000 triangles and the pistol and the sword at 10,000 or less. The next one is something called Air Console and this allows you to control something on your browser but the actual gamepad is the mobile device. And this is written in JavaScript with its own API, but has a C-sharp wrapper specifically for Unity to get this integrated. The next one is a virtual grasp free, and this is missing some specific bespoke features because it does have a pro version, but this does allow you to grab and interact with physical and non-physical objects like drawers, buttons, doors, anything like that. You can use the studio to pose objects, which you're going to be able to grasp. You can create and control animations, and it's a truly extendable solution for VR needs. The next one is something called Smart Console Free, which is an easy to use runtime console, which allows you to create your own commands within it. So if you're choosing to debug or something like that, when you're running your game, you want to put a little command into the console and you might want to test things that are specific to things that you've already created. The next one called package to folder is a really nice, really basic one. And this allows you to import a package into the Unity editor explicitly where you want it to be. So say you right click on a folder and you want it to be imported directly into that folder rather than it being, you know, you having to specify in a default location. The next one is status effects free, which is a sample pack of buffs, debuffs and status ailments with three buffs, one debuff, one status ailment and a demo scene with everything prefabbed and ready to roll. Because we've had a couple of VR themed items, this is a VR Beats kit, similar to that of a basic fundamental version of Beat Saber. And this uses the XR Interaction Toolkit, which was released by Unity recently, and it supports Unity Timeline, VR Interaction, and allows you to hit on the notes at specific times. This may be a great project to get yourself started. The next one is the Terrain Scanner Visual Effects, and this allows you to create that scan across terrain environments and be able to highlight specific objects within that and create that really cool effect if you've got a radar or you've got something which might find minerals in the environment. The next one is something called the Multiple Screenshot Editor, and this allows you to have a solution to save 
screenshots across different devices and resolutions and take all of those screenshots in one click. So whether you need to benefit from this for specific mobile screenshots or something that will be across different resolutions without going in and retaking them loads and loads of times. And the last one is the HDRP Surfaces Starter Pack. So this is a bunch of environmental assets with 10 different ground surface materials all PBR with 4K textures with dirt, dry grass, moss, rocks, forest and shorelines with all the maps that you need for HDRP to get painting and started on environmental creation. And now the free assets for January 2023 for the Unreal Engine which you can import into Unity and I'll put a link in the description for that too. So the first one we've got Did It Hit which is a trace detection plugin. So it's an optimized solution where the to be able to detect whether you've hit a specific collision with say a small bullet or a sword that you might have to make sure that you don't miss out on the things that you need. The next one is the Magic and the Spells Sounds Pro. So this is 615 high quality sound effects for magic spells, effects and elements with buffs, debuffs, casts, magical effects and so much more. The next one is the Orca Games Full Animations Bundle. So this does come with 398 different animations from their various different packs with their specific gym training sets, game animations with loads of different previews and everything that can work out of the box. The next one is the procedural biomes and these are game ready environments with different biomes, unique assets and procedural spawn systems to populate your own maps with three different biomes at two kilometer squared with a global wind system, unique foliage for each with 13 trees, nine rocks, 16 ground meshes, six bushes, 33 pieces of vegetation and loads of customization. And last but not least is the Triplex House Villa which is a large environmental house in an ArcViz style with seven different spaces and relevant objects with high quality meshes, 4k textures all with LODs for most of the objects, vertex count ranging from 500 to 6000 with 470 different meshes, 700 textures, all ready to go in a purpose-built environment in this awesome style. Be sure to come and check out all the links in the description for all the best sales and everything that you can find in Game Dev and Unity for this month. Be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 175 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Big thanks to all my patrons including Peter Steiner, Raheem Whitaker, Manos Barakas, Walter Dunson, René Leisure, Alyssa Faden, Daniel Gatujank, Ishikawa Takuya, Hush, Thomas Merseleski, Callum Murray, Mark Rondu, Marvin Church, Hoglan Naiguyan, Thomas Lopez, Curry for Life Gaming, Sunu, Jisung Park, Mercury27, Brandon Mannion, Austin Certain, Gene Wyquend, Duan Cooper, James McCarthy, Leslie Winter, Kelvin Martin, Heather Fletcher, Connor Droz, Mark Vacon, Andre Ferreira, Lawrence Yu, and Patrick Dominowski. And thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.